Ja, ein Profifußball ist der Druck ist ganz groß und man darf auf keinen Fall die Schwäche zeigen. Das heißt, du musst immer sagen, ja, ich habe kein Problem mit Alkohol, ich habe kein Problem mit Depression. Du musst quasi immer stark sein, obwohl das nicht so ist. Ich habe ein Kanzler testicular und aus raíz de eso, con tratamiento de quimioterapia, por momentos sufrí ansiedad en cuanto a otros problemas, pero la ansiedad fue lo que lo que más me 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 costó llevar. When I literally hit the floor and you come to the realization that ah, oh, this is actually a serious thing, I think that was probably the lowest of lows because I didn't know if I was going to come back from that or what the hell was happening. Do you recognize mental health problems? They describe a mental and emotional state that affects your thinking, feeling, behavior, and mood. You can have feelings of distress, anxiety, depression, sleep disturbance, and substance abuse. When these symptoms persist or affect your daily life, you might have a mental health problem. I've had severe depression, suicidal thoughts, anxiety, anorexia nervosa, if you want to do the proper term, and yeah, self-harm. La, la incertidumbre de, de no saber eh, qué era lo que venía, o sea, era todo nuevo para mí, para mi familia. Por más que los médicos me habían dado eh, pronósticos positivos, me habían dado un 95% de posibilidades de que todo iba a salir bien, este, uno no deja de pensar en ese 5 que Que puede, puede crecer. Mental health problems are common. They affect about one in four people in society. Among professional footballers, this rate could be even higher. According to FIFPRO research, 20 to 35% of active players reported mental health problems. These problems can have various causes, like the death of a loved one, a stressful relationship, or they can run in the family. They can also be related to football, like a serious injury, concussion, a bad relationship with your coach or teammates, performance pressures, or dissatisfaction with your career. I was in Frankfurt very, very happy, and then I went back to the I wanted to the Meisterschaft with my national Mannschaft. Und das hat leider nicht geklappt. Ich habe nicht gut gespielt in Gorbus. Ich war nicht glücklich in der Stadt. Und dann habe ich angefangen, Alkohol zu trinken, die Schlaftabletten nehmen. Und dann hat das eskaliert, dass ich aufs Fenster gefahren habe. People don't like to talk about their mental health problems because of stigmas and stereotypes. You probably have heard these negative reactions. You are weak if you have mental health problems. You can't have problems if you're successful. You'll lose your place on the team if you talk about your problems. Your problems are your own fault. None of these stereotypes are true. Any player can have a problem. Also, successful players can struggle with mental health problems. Talking about your problems is a sign of strength, not weakness. Das ist mein Beispiel. Ich habe über die Probleme nicht geredet und solange man nicht über die Probleme redet, kann man nichts ändern. Durante el tratamiento fui una psicóloga, eh, que la verdad en su momento me me ayudó a hablar con alguien fuera de mi entorno, que me diera otro punto de vista o que me hiciera ver cosas que que por ahí yo en el día a día no no veía. Eh, sinceramente, eh, a lo primero me ayudó. I think it helps when strangers tell you that something's not right. When, if it's a family member, if it's friends, it's kind of like, yeah, I'll brush it off easier. But when it's a stranger, I think that's when it hits closer to home, when you're like, oh, okay, there's something wrong. If you have mental health problems, then talk about it with someone you trust. This could be a friend, a family member, your player union, or a mental health professional. If you notice a teammate with problems, then show your understanding. Also, wenn man über die psychischen Probleme redet, ist das nicht peinlich. Ist das sogar, das ist die Stärke. Also. I think once you kind of give yourself time to understand those thoughts and emotions, it 
can help or it can sometimes be upsetting, but you need to confront them. Yo creo que, que la comunicación o, o hablar o sacar cosas de, de adentro eh, te fortalece y te hace agarrar fuerza que, que la verdad en su momento a mí me, me dio una, una mano muy grande.